get just uh, two steps forward and one step to your left. That should be... So you're on the right side of the screen. You're a ham for the camera. Start acting like a monkey. All right. And just tilt a little towards me. Yeah. And is she looking uh, right into the camera? No, you'll be looking at me. I'll, I'll kind of have half my head in here and half out. <laughs> I'm actually just taking a step this way and tilting more. There we go. Perfect. So can you just can't, uh, spell your name for me? I'll hold on to the mic. My name is Lisa Trudel. L-I-S-A-T-R-U-D-E-L. And how long have you been here for? I've been here for just over three weeks. So we're coming up on the four week, I guess today is the four week uh, mark. I guess it's not exactly an anniversary, but the mark. What, what, uh, what are you feeling today? I'm feeling gratitude. Um, thanks that we've been able to stay here for so long and for all the hardships that we've overcome and all the successes that we've accomplished. What are people generally feeling uh, after four weeks? I mean, is there a sense of... Uh, I think there's a sense of accomplishment that we can do this. We've been up against a lot, and we've had our challenges. I mean, we've, this is nothing like this has ever happened before, so I think people are, are feeling pretty good, but also uh, conscious and aware of the things that come in the future. Well, can you speak a little bit about that? I mean, uh, today we're finding out, you know, Toronto's getting evicted, uh, New York was evicted. Uh, what is that? What are people feeling about the future? I think we're just taking one day as it, like one day at a time, and taking it as it comes. We don't know what's going to happen or how long we're going to be able to stay. But the movement and what we're trying to do isn't just all come to live in a park. It's to create change and to create revolution and uh, connection and communication among the people. So whatever happens, it's not going to be the end. Is there any anxiety about? Potentially I'm not getting any. evicted? I'm not feeling any. No? I, I, people around here, I mean, they've been talking? I don't think so. I mean, it's been, we've been talking about it since day one. You know, it's always been a possibility if, the, if and when. And so, but, it, but not causing any anxiety. Yeah. Not that I've experienced. What about with, uh, with Winterlude coming in? The NCC is saying that it, the tents can't be here as win while Winterlude is here. They're sort of. You know, if you're reading the lines of what they're saying, they're saying that uh, an eviction is sort of what needs to happen here. Uh, if that, if it does come come down to that, how do you think people here will react? Well, we have a very diverse group of people here, so I'm predicting a very diverse uh, group of reactions, and that I'm sure we'll all work together to decide what our action is. And since it's a movement that's based on peace and understanding, I'm not saying that people are are going to walk out, even though they might. Um, but I'm sure we'll find a reasonable way of handling it. So when you say a diverse uh, reactions, I mean, it, what, can you just expand on that? I mean, how, how, how do you think most people are talking about? You know, obviously this must have been talked about, right? Like, yeah, I think, I think a lot of people are saying that we'll stay, we'll stay for as long as we can, and if there's a push to get people out, that, that we'll see it through. And yeah, we're not, a lot of people, yeah, I'm, I'm not sure how people will handle it because I've never experienced anything like that myself. So. so I guess there's a lot of uncertainty as to how, yeah. how it'll go down exactly? I'd say so. Okay. Um, and so, yeah, I mean, with it, with everything uh, going on, I mean, Toronto is getting shut down. Is that uh, going to increase or diminish the uh, presence here in Ottawa? It's hard to say what it'll do. Um, there, we just we've got a really core, great core group of people that are really pushing the movement and are excited about that happens. And the challenges that we face are just the challenges that we face. 
um, and they only serve to make us stronger. So I think it's not going to affect those who are who are whose hearts are in this, and then everyone else. It's a push and pull. I'll just reiterate one of my first questions, but it's sort of same same question. But uh, is is there a sense that that uh, a confrontation or a, the, the eviction is sort of impending? I mean, do people here have that sense? It's definitely the sense the NCC is getting. Out. Yeah, uh, I think that's been a, a sense since day one that it could be just around the corner. Um, so something. Just that. Okay. And yeah, like I said, we'll just take it as it comes. So winter loot is nothing new. I mean, this isn't anything that's shocking anybody. Not me, at least. Okay. Thanks a lot.